So today I want to show you how you can get your um, photos to your post to automatically appear on Twitter when you copy and paste a link to Twitter or someone goes and shares one of your blog posts and how um, your featured image or an image from your blog post automatically gets inserted into um, Twitter without you manually getting it. So how that's done is via Twitter cards. So what Twitter cards are are a little bit of code that's been added to your WordPress website that Twitter reads to grab those images and display it. So um, the very first step what you want to do is you go to um, uh, this Twitter card validator link and if you insert your URL uh, with your HTTP here in front and if you do preview card you'll see right now I get an error that's because I don't have the card um, currently inserted or don't have the code currently inserted so I'll show you how you get your code so we're going to use a plugin it's called JM Twitter cards so um, I already have it installed but I'm going to activate it here and um, once you have it activated you can either click on the settings here or on the left hand side you'll have this new section called JM Twitter cards so if you click on that you'll see um, a whole bunch of settings and so this is a pretty advanced tool but we'll show you just the basic settings here you want to make sure you have your Twitter um, handle here and uh, the card type you want to display so you can do a summary where it just um, shows like an excerpt of your post a summary below a large image or just a photo so I'm gonna say photo here and um, another important setting is in the images tab so on the images tab it allows you to upload your default photo for your website so if they can't find a photo or um, especially on your home page if you want if someone shares that on Twitter that URL you want it to display this image so I just um, grabbed my logo essentially and put it here so I'm gonna save all these settings and now it should have installed some code so now if I go back to my website my home page and um, if you are in Chrome or a similar browser if you go uh, view source um, view source here you'll see that there's a section here that added this uh, Twitter me metadata so this is the stuff that Twitter is looking for so as you can see um, on the home page this is the image that it's going to grab and that is my logo there so uh, let's go back to the validator and now I'm going to try again okay so now it's not coming back with an error and I do see an image here but you'll see that it is I get it a little warning here that's not whitelisted so um, this is telling Twitter that you want your website um, you are you allow your website to be um, for the photos to be grabbed so I'm just gonna request approval here and it shows me just to fill in some information about my site so WordPress So I will do that and request approval. Okay, and so now it is pending approval. Um, sometimes it might get approved right away, which is awesome, but other times it might take a little bit more time. Um, okay, anyway, so if we go back to our code or we go back to our uh, site here. Now um, let's see an individual post. So let's go to our posts and I'll just show you what it looks like on um, in a post. Um, you have now a Twitter section 
Twitter card section where it shows you a preview for your post. So this is what's going to happen when somebody shares this post. Um, if I do want to change it, or if I do want to change the image, I can do that. If I want to change um, to maybe a player, if I have a video, then uh, maybe I'll do that. Um, but uh, right now I'll just put it to photo. And so you update that. Okay. So now I'm going to check back here and see if I've been actually approved yet. Yay, and I have been. So I've been approved. I've, uh, um, I've been approved three minutes ago. So now I'm going to go back to my website and I'm going to show you what an actual um, Twitter card is going to look like as well. So I click on my post link and I'm just going to copy this link. Now I'm going to go back to my Twitter and I'm probably annoying my Twitter feed because I've done this a million times. Um, and I'm going to post that link. I'm just going to put test in front of here and I'm going to tweet that out. So now if I go back to that tweet and I take a closer look click on details. Now I see that that image has been added like I want it to show. And so I have a little summary here at the bottom. But if you don't want that summary, just um, add a photo. And so um, that's how you can add uh, photos to your uh, Twitter feed from your WordPress website. And um, I hope that this was useful and I hope to be making more videos uh, in the future about WordPress. So please subscribe to my YouTube feed and um, I'll see you again soon.